So I've been waiting for a sunny day. Hi, Bobby. Coming with? Waiting for a sunny day. Tomorrow's Christmas. Take a look at what the house looks like. After, uh, almost three years since the fire. Be three years in April. Take a quick look around the outside and then uh, go inside. You can see the uh, concrete in the front where the pond is. There's going to be a bridge over the pond and a big portico maybe next week. Well, the dining room is back there. It used to be the kitchen. Main living room. And it's a, got this beautiful woodwork overhead. That's the fourth bedroom back there. That's our laundry room. And the, one of the doors into the master. That's the uh, large window in the master. And looking out past that direction, back towards the cottage a little. And this is the back of the house where the electrical room is. And I've mentioned this before, our land actually goes another almost 300 feet in that direction into the woods. Very steep. That's the pool. Well, continuing on around the outside. This is all wilderness here. It's all uh, open space wilderness preserve on three sides of us. Again, it's some nice woodwork up there. Mostly bathroom windows here. It's one of the windows for the... Uh, that's actually going to be Morello's bedroom. This is the uh, third bedroom. And that is actually the uh, door into the pantry. So going around, that's the window into the garage. I'm just gonna, there will be a gate here, there used to be, we we'll come down, and the door into the garage is now on this side, that's the trim they're putting on. So this is the garage. One of the best views around here is actually from the garage. I used to love, before the fire, just to come out and sit here. And I'd sit in one of Gary's old chairs, actually, and, and just look at the view. The garage is a fabulous view. The rest of the house does, too. Well, this is the pantry big cabinets over here on the left and a big uh, bypass door closet there and a half bath this is kind of a breakfast nook on that side the kitchen goes here those are the doors for the den these are uh, bypass uh, doors and then uh, you can see the kind of the way the ceiling is done here. Pretty different. It's pretty high up there. I wouldn't go up there. But then I'm a chicken. All right, these are the doors. This go, there'll be a terrace here. Outside the um, dining room, there'll be a terrace. 
between here and the pond. And uh, my Bobby boy came in. Hi, Bobs. That's one of the arches. And then uh, here we go. Those are the big windows. And uh, of course, the plastic's still on all the new windows. That is the fireplace. And this was saved. This was saved from the uh, original home at great uh, cost, but certainly it's what I wanted. I have to save something. The, uh, I don't want this to be too long, but that's the where the entry door goes. It's actually, if you can see, that's actually 10 feet high and 6 feet wide. We're thinking a single pivot door. And this is the hallway. It's like uh, 28 feet up there, but uh, you walk back through here, down this really tall hallway, and you start to see where the bedrooms are and that type of thing. This is the master, it has its own fireplace, and uh, bag of concrete, and an old dog. Two old dogs up here, Bobby, you and me. That's it for now. Bye.